hello guys welcome back to my channel i'm zaini and today's video is about me doing my first ever wash and go as you can see my hair is freshly washed to check out my wash day routine check the um video up on the screen now my hair is in sections because it's way easier for me to work with sections so i've put my hair in sections ready to start applying the product on my hair <laughs> so i'll get my rat tail comb losing out that section as you can see my hair is looking soft and moisturized after deep conditioning and washing my hair then i'll be patting that particular section into a smaller section So as you can see, I've parted that section into the smaller section and I'll be spraying water on my hair. Make sure to make, make sure your hair is damp when you're doing a wash and go. And I get my tangle teaser to detangle that section and loosen up my curls. As you can see, can you see how bouncy that looks? So I'll be taking my Share Moisture Curling Gel Souffle. Ooh looks so thick and i'll be applying that on my hair from the roots to the end you can see i'm running my fingers through it so you can see how it looks after i've applied the sheer moisture coiling gel souffle on my hair my curls are looking defined not bad so i'll be doing the same thing i'll also be sectioning that section into a smaller section so that i can get the curls to be more defined when you work in smaller sections it's easier for your curls to look defined then i get my tangle teaser to detangle from the ends of my hair then taking it up to the roots Then I get my coiling gel souffle and I apply that to that section of my hair. Make sure it sinks in. I'm finger detangling because of I need the curls to be defined and to loosen up my curls. That's why I'm running my fingers through it so that the curls can look defined. As you can see, I'm also detangling if there's any knots, I'm detangling it. So I'm done with that section, guys. As you can see, there's a difference between that section and the other sections. So I'll be getting a hairband. And I'll be rolling it around my, the roots of my hair. The reason why I'm using the hairband is because I want my hair to look full and thick. Like, I want to stretch out the roots of my hair because my hair tends to shrink a lot. Like, the shrinkage with my hair is really really bad so i'm putting that hair band just to stretch out the roots of my hair so that my hair can look full and it can look thick so as you can see i'm done just the roots i did not focus on the ends i just added the band to the roots and I'll be doing the same thing to other sections of my hair. The same procedure to other sections of my hair. So I'm done doing the back. I'm done adding the products and adding the hairband to the back of my hair. Now I'm going to do the front. As you can see, I'm using the tangle teaser. You can see how bouncy and how coily that looks. Ooh. So I'll be applying the coiling gel souffle to that section of my hair. As you can see, I'm running my fingers through that particular section so that I can loosen up the curls. You can see how that looks. Okay, not looking bad. So you can see the difference between that other section and the section that I've added the product. You can see the difference. 
so i'm done with all the sections yes it's still wet and it's dripping <laughs> round my hair my face my and my neck so guys i'm going to go and air dry this for a bit and i'll be right back so guys i'm done my hair is dry i wouldn't say it's dry dry i'm going to be taking off the hairband for my hair i wouldn't say it's like dry yet but it's not damp like the way it was looking before at least it's dry to an extent so i'll be taking off my hairband now off each section of my hair so guys i'm done as you can see this is how the end result is my hair is not looking so defined like the way i expected it to look but my hair really feels soft and moisturized so my curls isn't so defined so guys you can help me by commenting on the best technique or product i can use to get a defined wash and go on my 4c hair because right now i need to try a new technique for this wash and go so if you would like to see more natural hair videos don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe to this channel bye